You ready to fight? Ready. Good. All right, here we go with round one featuring one of the best recent welterweight signees, Michael Venom Page. And for an athlete like this, he would not have enjoyed his retirement nearly as much if he didn't try to chase a few wins in the UFC. This will always be the greatest proven ground in all of mixed martial arts. And MVP Michael Venom Page out to prove that his game will absolutely translate at the highest level of the sport. Oh, misses with the jab. All right, so one minute into this fight and not much to dissect in terms of action. You may need to go use the restroom. Might, mean, might be a good time. John, is it time? <laughs> Concession break. I'll be back with a hot dog. Nice strike lands. Just missed with the left there. Big body kick. Just over three minutes now to go. Nice kick there by Thompson. And he caught the kick. Well, just like he drew it up with us on Thursday, catches the kick, counters beautifully with the takedown. He did a great job countering with that nice takedown. Great fight IQ, seeing that kick coming and turning it into his offense. Lead kick landed there by Wonderboy Thompson. What a great job getting that kick to the target. Turning his hip over into the leg kick. Nice job blocking that shot. Oh, nice. Another blistering combination there. Really starting to do a nice job stringing his shots together. And you can see the damage in his opponent's body. His face, his body, his legs. He's beating him up on all the targets. It's not... One guy just headhunting. He is finding every opening that is presented to him. Oh, huge kick to the body. 45 seconds remain in the round. Well, we'll see if he can turn this defense into offense, but he's doing a great job blocking shots here tonight. As of right now, he's thinking more defensively, and he's doing a great job of not taking any damage. And he lands that side kick. Final seconds here. Back kick there. The Round two is next. All right, now we take a look back at some of the highlights. He has had his kicking game going early and often tonight. I mean, on point, right? He knew that this was going to be a way for him to take control of this fight. He's used those kicks to really put it. You ready to fight? Ready. Let's do it. All right, here we go with round two. All right, so as this next round gets underway, hopefully the good action we saw in the last round will continue. Both fighters certainly had their ups and downs. Both got the offense going. But now we'll see if one fighter or the other can really take control of what has been a very close fight thus far. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Oh, big head kick there. The knee's now going. the swing and there's the miss by Thompson. Well, now you see some visible damage on the side underneath the elbow. He told us he was going to invest in the body and he hasn't missed a whole lot tonight. You didn't expect him to do it this effectively. He's done a fantastic job of following the game plan. Ooh, big shot lands. Don't stop. Keep 
locked under three minutes now to go in the round. Oh, beautiful jab there. It's one thing to have length. Of course, it's another to use it effectively. Beautiful job with that jab. Oh, and there he goes, working off that jab again. How's your jab? You I mean, the jab's nice. I love throwing the jab. But you realize that as MMA evolved... I'm not sure his opponent knows where he is. No, he is on Beach Street right now. He's seeing Tweety Birds over the top of his head. When you take a hook like that, you are on wobbly legs. All right, he's been very clean with his hooks on the feet here tonight, and it's the way he set it up that has really impressed you. Yeah, it's very impressive to see him pop the jab, pop the right hand, just touch, 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 and then boom, sit down on that hook. He's going to be trying to find it again. You can see him setting up his opponent, trying to get the hands to drop so he can drop that hook over the top. Well, he was setting up the hooks early and often tonight. Watch for him to try to set it up again here. All right, so now blood is a factor. You see that he has been opened up in that eye area. Yeah, he's got hit in the eye, and now there's a cut. But it's nothing to worry about too much now. Been a crazy fight. All right, well, good news is he rocked him. Bad news is he wasn't able to finish the job, and now his opponent's back in the fight. I mean, you don't get those opportunities very often. You got to take full advantage of them when they're presented to you. All right, round three coming up next. All right, there's the horn indicating the end of the round. So potentially a big factor here, ladies and gentlemen. The cut on the cheek sustained in that round. Certainly better to be below than above the eye, but the cut man's got to get in there and close that thing up. All right, so a big knockdown in that last round. DC will show you the replay. Nearly had him out of there. He almost did. Ready fight. Ready. Round three of a possible five. Quick jab. Nice deception there as he lands the hook. Well, new round, same result as he continues to punish the body yet again, just as he did in the previous round. Throwing that jab yet again out of range. Nice. There it is, another strike to the body. That has been a big storyline in this fight. We'll keep an eye on it as the bout continues. You know, we'll keep an eye on it. But the person that should be addressed it is his opponent. His opponent isn't doing anything to, to deter him from doing this constantly. He has got to change something if he wants to fight this fight and win this fight. Under three minutes now to go in round three. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to pile up these body shots here in the latter stages of this fight. You didn't see a lot of that in the earlier rounds, making up for lost time here. Trying to go to the body here, unable to find the target. Thompson's shot is blocked. Heavy on the cut, heavy on the cut. Side kick is there. You can catch a body kick, but you gotta step off to the side. You just can't take it clean. Thompson's got a nasty bruise starting to appear on that left side. We'll keep an eye on it. Could pay dividends later. Straight right hand now just misses. They're so evenly matched, and they're going tit for tat. Clean punch. Liver kick. Under a minute to go. This work. We need to work. Thank you. 
And blocks the shot there. Well, we got a lot of blood now. I'm not sure how he stayed up there. I mean, when you get hit with a shot like that, to stay standing shows and talks to your toughness. Oh! oh. And what a round! All right, there's the horn. The round is over, but not before he was cut on his nose from the strikes in that round. Back to the stool. Cut man is in. Should be able to shut that cut and prevent it from becoming an issue moving forward. But, of course, as soon as he gets struck in that next round, it could open back up. Well, I'm not sure the extent to which he has recovered, but we do see the end of the round. DC, talk us through the replay. Well, he's a tough guy. He's going to make it to the stool. You ready to fight? You ready? Let's do it. We have arrived at the fourth round fight schedule for five five-minute rounds. All right, so here we go. You can feel the tension. Fourth round is underway. We'll see who has the upper hand here. You feel it inside of the arena. The fighters feel it inside of the octagon. It's palpable. The energy is crazy because you understand that in the next 10 minutes, someone's going to get a belt strapped around their waist. It's amazing. And there's that jab. Well, champ, I don't see that well, but it's hard to miss the redness underneath that elbow. A lot of bodily investment from his opponent tonight. Yeah, it's an investment, John. It may not pay dividends right now, but the more you go there, the more damage you do, eventually it will show itself. Right now, it's starting to show. Straight right, he misses. Back and forth we go. Well, he continues to do a nice job here defensively protecting the head and sort of maybe letting his opponent gas out a little bit with all the volume. His opponent sees the target, but he can't get to the target. So he'll continue to throw, and he'll continue to wear on his own gas tank. Good jab. Well, he keeps going back to the well with that left hand just out of range. Nice job blocking that punch. Just over two minutes to go. Nice kick there by Thompson. Nice job to raise the guard and block another strike there. He doesn't want the ringside position anywhere near this octagon. He has to understand that at any moment, if this thing goes down into the eye, the referee and the commission will have to stop the fight. Great job being aware, keeping the hands up and blocking, making sure to minimize the damage to that already cut eye. Beautiful body kick. Nice defense there, huge block. Oh, heavy kick downstairs. One minute to go in the round. Oh, that hook has been there all night. There's another one by Thompson. Well, he's had next to no answers for the body shots here tonight, and now some redness really starting to develop on that. Man, look what that one body shot did to his opponent. That shows his power. The power in the placement. It was placed perfectly, and now he's got his opponent hurt. What a fight so far. Headgear's not allowed. Oh! Liver kick! Oh, he is 
is hurting for certain. Well, he's looking for that left hand. Just out of range, though, with it. Oh, just digs into the line. Bobby felt that shot in every part of himself. And now he's got his opponent hurt. Now we're going. Wonderboy gets up. He is back on the feet. Looked like he was in a submissive state on the ground, but he worked hard there to get back to the feet. Able to land to the body there with the left kick. Oh, there's the head kick, it's blocked. You know, a lot of people say those don't land, but even if you block them a little bit, they still put damage on you. Oh, stuffs the takedown without issue. Caught the kick. All right, so a nice straight punch there after he caught the leg. He decides to punch out as opposed to going for any takedown. Ah, oh, he's been working hard defensively. Kick block there. Hands on your face. Oh, caught him flush with the head kick there, DC. Beautiful setup to get his leg up there quickly before his opponent could react. Nice crack there. Trademark inside leg kick there by Thompson. And that spinning kick out, it's home up top. Now to go in the fight. Nice jab by Thompson. 20 seconds to go in the fight. And now some separation. Oh, and there's the final horn. We go to the scorecards. One of the greatest fights that we have seen all year. Well, we are the only two men sitting in this arena tonight after a 25-minute title fight there. Epic back-and-forth affair. I think the challenger might have done enough. The champ didn't want to let go of his title. He fell a little bit short, and we should have a new UFC champion. He did a great job of using his all-around MMA game in order to take the belt away from the champ. The official decision is in. It resides with Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. For the winner by split decision, and new undisputed UFC welterweight champion of the world, 